Hi Pisces, welcome in. Carolina Moon here, getting ready to do your March uh, 5th through the 15th reading. Um, see what's coming towards you um, in regards to love and your spiritual and see what's happening. Um, I know I was gone for a while. I had a really bad um, illness, but I'm back now. So you'll see more of me. <laughs> and thanks for hanging in there. Um, and thanks for all your love and support. Okay, guys, so let's get going. Pisces, happy birthday month. Oh, man. Okay. Um, we're going to do... Um, Check the wisdom of the oracle here um, and see what's coming towards you. Okay, what's coming towards our Pisces, my guys? And um, I'm here to receive messages for my beautiful Pisces, March 4th through the 15th um, and beyond now. Whatever they need to hear, my darlings, my beautiful guides. I have a beautiful guide named Josephine that is with me all the time. Josephine is here with us. Okay. All right, darling. Chop wood. Okay, looks like we have some work energy, some things that need to get done. Can you see that? Uh, I'm asking if you can see it like you can <laughs> answer me. Chop wood. Chop wood. This is like, you know, preparation. You know, preparation before the big party. Cleaning everything up, sweeping, dusting, chop wood. Wow, okay, so I'm getting a message with this now, and that is chop wood, like chopping things out, just like you clean out your your house, right? You sweep out the dirt, you take out the dirt. <laughs> okay, so some of you might be letting go of somebody that is not there for your highest good, or... You might be letting go of things that, you know, habits or or um, people that are just not resonating with you anymore. People that aren't working, things that, that aren't going well um, as far as influence and um, your spiritual life and your path where you want to see yourself or go. So it looks like we're... We're definitely in preparation for a future celebration is what I'm feeling. And we are definitely letting go of things that no longer serve us with that. Whoa, that's awesome. Okay, next one, the here and now. Yeah, you're concentrating on that. The here and now. Being here, being now. Um, not um, looking back into your past and not... Um, not looking into the future, but being present, present in the here and now. So there could be somebody, if we're going to, you know, be talking about people, there could be somebody that you're cutting out that's in the now that is not serving you. Um, or you are literally in the process right now of uh, preparation for something like that or like, you know, um, getting ready for spring cleaning. Uh, spiritually and emotionally, maybe physically in the home, you know? Okay. Exchanging gifts. Exchanging gifts. So there's probably friends helping you along this and to help you to, you know, encourage you to get to this point and encouraging you to, um, to release and you know possibly adding to your celebration adding to your experience adding to your decision 
and in return you're adding to theirs so that's pretty beautiful it almost looks like they're you know they're exchanging gift but it kind of feels like a high five to me it's just really feels like comradeship to me like your friends your comrades your you know your mates that kind of thing wow okay okay all right I'm gonna pull one. they want me to pull one more from the bottom okay round and round so that makes sense it makes perfect sense because it feels like there's been a situation in your life that just keeps going round and round and it's time to end it to let go for it that to stop yes absolutely okay thank you my guy it's fantastic okay so we're gonna pull some tarot cards and I'm just gonna do some shuffling here for our Pisces my beautiful Pisces and we're going to see I see what's coming towards you what's uh, what's what are these all about what are the messages that, that our Pisces need to hear okay I'm gonna be offering an extended read um, with this so you are welcome to um, follow me on over there and we'll get more information get messages from the other person's higher self your higher self for you um, if not, it's okay, it's fine, it's okay. All right, our Pisces, let's see. What is the message that's coming towards our Pisces? Okay. So glad to be back, so glad to be feeling better. Man, I was getting kind of worried there for a while. I have a really good friend. His birthday is on um, St. Patty's Day every year. Pretty fun. Okay, here we go, darlings. Any messages that need to come through? We are flowing. Okay, I'm going to just kind of get start pulling cards as an overall feel for the situation. Information here. Well, you really, you are represented here as the Nine of Cups, which is incredible. So, this is how you're represented. You are wish come true. You are happy, happy. Um, things look great. Um, you're, you're, you feel strong. You feel like you need, you feel well, and you are, you're victorious. The situation is the Six of Wands here. So we've got, we've got, you're definitely feeling victorious here. You're, you're, um, you're feeling really good. We've got some possibility of some devil energy coming in. Um, there's a possibility of you, you know, of course, always just giving up, right? And, and going back to that old round and round thing that's going on. Um, now that's a possibility. It's, it doesn't mean that it's gonna happen. I feel like, I feel really confident that you are just, you're chopping wood, you're, you're here and you're now, and you're deciding that you don't want this round and round stuff. This other person was not, uh, it just, you're, you're tired of that. You want new. You want something different. It's not working for you. Boy, can I relate to that. Um, so we've got, yes, you completely letting go because, see, this is the devil. The devil and then right after the devil is the two of swords reverse, which is this is really you deciding, no, I'm taking off my, off the blinders. I'm taking off the blinders and I'm moving forward. I'm not gonna be stuck in this devil energy. Yeah, so this is happening right now, 
okay? It's happening now. It's either happening like, I, I just feel like it's happening as I'm speaking. So it's happening right now. And um, so your higher self really wants you to, to hold on to what you're doing right now. Stay focused, hold on to it. And also um, money-wise, hold on to your money, okay? Um, in your here, it's showing me that in your recent past that you definitely are, you've got somebody there that is not the right match because we have the lovers reversed. They're not the right match. So that is definitely what the conclusion that you came to. Um, so it looks like you're going to be, um, looks like you're going to let your, your, you know, your defense down. And you're going to be really, I really feel like this is uh, you expressing how you really feel about this situation and um, not block, you know, not putting up any walls. You're, you're letting the walls down. You're saying, I'm just, this is how I feel. I just, I don't want to do this anymore. And you're opening up to people that normally you would, you know, be on the defense you would be like I don't want to tell them what's real you know that kind of thing and now you're telling them you're telling the people in your life that you love you're telling them how you feel and it's it's giving you this victory over this situation I'm so proud of you this is fantastic I'm so proud of you okay and you're really represented here as the ten of wands reversed you're laying this burden down you're done you're laying it down Man, that's fantastic. This is how people are seeing you. They're seeing you as, I'm done. I'm, I'm, I'm just, and you know, uh, they're going to be so happy about it. They're going to be so happy. Like, okay. And then we've got, let me just look a little bit here. So we've got the queen for, um, it's in the position of um, the immediate near future, my loves. So this is you, this is you sitting in your power. This is you working on your uh, finances, working on your surroundings. I mean, look at the surroundings of this card. Look at everything that surrounds her. And she's got the one huge, large golden pentacle there. She is surrounded with beauty and nature and, and earth. She is grounded. She is nurturing everything, everything beautiful in the crown on her head. She is, so this is you. Holy moly, babies. Wow. So we've got three pentacles here, which, which is, is earth. And this is really, you might have a lot of earth in your chart, but this is you really focusing on your, um, your money. And then we've got the fool and it's, it's really the fool is about you deciding, you know what? I want that new life. I'm jumping off in that new life. I'm done with this other burden of going round and round. I want to see, and I'm excited to see what comes next. What's coming next? Wow. Okay. Okay. And then we've got um, the seven of pentacles reverse, which is really you just dropping everything and, and, and leaving the situation. This whole theme of, of this thing is there is somebody in your life, somebody in your life that you've been going round and round with that either is not committed to you. Okay. They are not emotionally equipped, emotionally committed. Um, they might want to. They're, they might not have the capacity to, but they... Um, so I don't know what the reason is, um, but they, they just don't have it. And they never will have it. And so it's just not... It's like square peg, round hole thing, a theme again. <laughs> It's like um, unrequited love in the sense that this person, 
you have so much to give. You have so much in your heart to give. You are a queen. Okay, you are a queen. And this person or this other circumstance in your life is the only thing that it, only place that it has reached is in as far as fulfillment is, an, is like an addictive, an addictive fulfillment. Something that you got used to, a pattern, something that you got used to. And when that happens, that brings in negativity. I mean, you know, anything that's wrapped up in the devil brings in negativity, and we all know, okay? And um, this is what this has brought, and this is what is leaving. So that's what I'm going to say to you. This is what is leaving, and your path is going completely in a different direction. You are like, I am going off, and I'm the all the effort that I make is going to be in with myself I'm putting all the effort into myself oh my gosh wow okay guys we're gonna dig a little deeper and get a little information um, you know why not let's get some information about what's coming uh, towards you and um, um, actually I want to I want to um, I want to get information more information from your higher self and and check out the romance angels and see what they say see if there's anybody coming in if you're if you're on the brink of something here but i'm super super thrilled to be back and um, i hope you follow me over there if not mm, much love to you and good job good job guys good job for walking away a whole new life happening all right darlings chop wood chop wood Mwah. bye bye see you later